Hello, air people. Microsoft released Microsoft Copilot for Office 365. I use Office 365 Enterprise at work, and so it's still not available in my case. Plus, it's $40 a month per user, and that's unlikely to ever get approval. Luckily, it was easy for me to make a free alternative. I called it Olama Copilot. I used Windows Forms, which could run on Windows and Mac. I used Olama through Docker Desktop, which has GPU acceleration on Windows. The Llama 2 model works with the chat API, and I use that for the back end. All right, so let's go through this. Go ahead and launch it. Here we go. So this application has the text box for input. And click on the prompt button. And that will submit the prompt to the back end. And it'll print the response down there. I can also say, Also hit control enter and that will also submit the prompt. There we go. There's also this uh, application uh, drop down here. So if I switch over to the first use case, so I've got a word. All right, so here's the whole genesis of the, the thing. So $40 a month to get AI in here when I could just do this. All right, so write five paragraphs about Mark Zuckerberg, you know, because it's using the Llama 2 model. All right, and it'll think about it. And when it gets a response, it's going to send the output to the selected application here. There we go. So as soon as it gets a response, it minimizes and it pastes it right in. So there's Word. We can also do Excel. Here we go. Create a product table with common columns. And I'll use the application dropdown quick Excel window. Control enter. Now this is the faster one because it doesn't have to write five paragraphs here. Okay, there we go. So you can see it pasted in. So everything is in different cells and there's a nice table. Cool. All right, so let's go on to another example. Let's see if it can write C. All right, numbers 1 to 100 in C. So print numbers one hundred and C plus plus. Sure. Before it's back, I wanted to go to Visual Studio. There we go. All right, so it did the whole thing. So let's just do that. Main. Right. There we go. And oh my gosh, curly braces on the same line. Okay. From that. There you go. We can see it worked. This will work with any application. It's just uh, whatever application goes to the foreground, it'll add it to the list of applications. 
And you can just switch to it by name. If the list gets long, you can just close it and run it again. Okay. There's an overview of Olama Copilot. Thanks for watching. And remember to always make AI features free, or at least try. See you next time.